Okay, go back to the um, question you was talking about, Torley. Now, say, for instance, like, you like your job, and you know um, you have an option to, you know, like, do it at another place. Would that be considered twirling with, with your job? It, now, now, say that again. I say, say, like, you like your job, mm -hmm. okay? But you do, you do it at another place, but it's still, like, the same job. You know, and you're not just doing it because of the money, but that's because you like to do it. Would that still be considered toiling? What? Uh, um, on, on your job. What, toiling? Yeah. No, no, the, the thing, uh, toiling is a physical, mental, where it, it's, it's, it's like not that you just physically, it, it's like you are drained. See, you, you, you could have a job that doesn't require much uh, physicality out of you, but you mentally drain. And we should never be that at no case. Something is out of order. You know, that's what we mean by, 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 by toiling, because that, that's under, under the curse. Because remember, part of the curse when Adam messed up was uh, uh, you work by the sweat of your brow. Especially in a ground that's not productive. So you even got to uh, kind of, you can even kind of identify certain things, what you're doing, if there's no productivity there, it's not, if it's not productive. Does that kind of make any, any sense? Now, usually with most things, and once again, most of us were not taught this or this or that, even when it comes to jobs and positions, as Christians, we should ask God about it. You know, because really our mindset should be, this is an assignment. Yes. This is not my source. Yes. Yes. See, if, 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 if God told you to work at the fast food place that's only paying $2.65 an hour, $2.65 an hour, if he told you to be there, your lifestyle could be $10 million. Yes. And on the same token, you can be somewhere that's paying six figures and God don't want you there. You can be miserable. So once again, and that ain't no, no, no condemnation to none of us. A lot of us were not told that and didn't understand it because, you know, we, we, even when it comes to what we might think is a promotional advancement, Lord, what are you saying about it? Lord, what do you say? When it comes to even making... Uh, important decisions, like even buying certain things. Lord, what do you say about this? Is this the car to buy? Is this the house you want me to go to? Lord, what do you say? You know, because I told you that story that car I bought, that was an Ishmael. <laughs> and it ended up burning up, catching on fire. You know, so, so, so sometimes we ask God on, on being wherever, but, but, the, but the evidence of toiling, really, you're not content, you just, you just drain, you're just tired, you just, it's just, whew. and then you have to ask the Lord, Lord, what's happening here? You know, maybe I should not be here or doing this or, or whatever, or like I say, you could be where you should do it, you just need some adjustments in your life. But we're not to be taller, you know. Never, we're not to tall. Not at all. I had to learn that years ago, even pastoring and in ministry. Because that was a period I didn't know what I was taught. And I was taught that that's kind of a good thing. Like, ooh, you know, it's, it's good to be tied for the Lord. Because <laughs> I spent years kind of thinking about that, that more I must have didn't really put it out there, you know, if I don't come home all falling out. And then people would use scripture like, like Jesus, you know, when the woman... Touch, one with dish of blood, touch him, virtue, a power had gone at him. So I was always expecting after I preached, the minister, Ooh, I'm, let me just fall out. You know, and, and, and that was the thing. And, and that, it's not supposed to be like that. See, a lot of that, that getting tired stuff was because that was some fleshly stuff I added in. Don't let me get started with that. A lot of twists and turns and, ah, and blow my throat out and hurt my back and 